Hello and welcome to Quick Tips, the WooCommerce video series. In the previous video, we installed the free Quick View plugin on the WooCommerce website. So this was the plugin. When you click on the Quick View button, people will be able to see the description of the product on the same page. So they do not need to go to the product page. They will see the Quick View of the product on the same page. Now in this video, we are going to install a free plugin which will give you an option to compare the products on the WooCommerce website. So let's see, this is the plugin. On the shop page, you will see this compare button. Now, when you click on this compare button, it will open the comparison table. So from here, customer will be able to add products for the comparison. Let me click on let's compare. And this is the compare table. So from here, I can add products for the comparison. So this is the second product that I have added for the comparison. You can add more products. You can also limit the number of products for the comparison. So here you will see the image, the title, the rating price, add to cart, description content, and you can also add other fields of the product for the comparison. And you can also remove the product from the comparison. Here you can remove from here. You can close the compare bar. You can go to the next page and you can add another product to the comparison so here you it will add another product so let's see how does this work do not forget to subscribe to quick tips youtube channel watch new videos about website design e-commerce websites search engine optimization social media marketing wordpress tutorials video editing tips and many more press the bell icon to get instant notification whenever we publish new videos so i'm logged into the dashboard of the woocommerce website and we are going to install the free plugin for the product comparison in the WooCommerce website. So let's go to plugins and then click on add new. So this will be a free plugin. And here search for WPC Smart Compare. So this is the plugin WPC Smart Compare for WooCommerce. So click on install now and click on activate. Alright, so the plugin has been activated. Here you will see WP Clever option. In the previous video, we installed this Smart Quick View. So now we have installed this Smart Compare plugin. So click on Smart Compare. We are going to change the settings. Okay, so this is the settings page. Now first setting, hide on cart and checkout page. So we do not want to show them compare button on the cart or the checkout page. So let it be on yes hide if empty so the button the comparison bar will be hidden if the bar is empty so if you do not add any product for the comparison the, the compare bar will not be shown now limit how many products do you want the customer to add for the comparison so you can limit the number of products for the comparison so right now i'm going to set for the five so people will not be able to add more than five products for the comparison so you can change the number from here compare page so you will need to set up one compare page so right now i have one test page on this website so i'm going to set up the test page as the compare page it's a blank page i have now compare button it will be a button so i'm not going to change it instead of button you can you can also set up link so i'll set it on the button and what action do you want open compare table so these are the different actions when you click on this button so I want them to see the comparison in the sidebar. So I'm going to set up the sidebar. We will also check the compare table later. So right now set to open compare sidebar. Okay, so if you have any extra class, you can set up the class here. Position on archive page. Where do you want to show this button? I'm going to set it on above add to cart button. And you can set up this compare button on the single page. In, on the single product page also and the position I'm going to set is above add to cart button okay now I want to show for all categories change button text so I'm not going to make any changes here position to the right the sidebar position will be on the right side now these are the fields which will be included for the comparison if you do not want to show any of the field you can uncheck the field Okay, so remaining settings i'm going to leave them as they are and let's click on save changes so you can play with the settings and you can change the position 
and other settings okay now let's go to the reef so this is the shop page and this is the quick view that we set up in the previous video okay now let me refresh this one now here you will see the compare button so let me click on the compare button let me see one of the products here so we are going to compare this t-shirt so let's click on compare and when I click on compare you will see the right side bar here okay so now click on let's compare so it will show the product comparison page and from here people will be able to add product for the comparison so when I click on plus sign it will ask you to enter the keyword so I'm going to set up enter t-shirt so this is the t-shirt I'm going to compare so one more product has been added for the comparison let's add one more three shirts now it's four five let's try to add sixth product and you will get the message you can add a maximum of five products to compare table so click on ok so you won't be able to add more than five products you can change this number in the settings so here you will see the comparison the image, the rating, price, add to cart button, description, content, dimensions and if there are other fields they can be shown on this page. So this is how they can compare the products page. Now if I want to remove I can simply remove from here okay, or you can click on this X button from here and it will be removed from the comparison. Now let's remove all of them. So right now you can see that only one product is in the comparison table and when I move the cursor it bar the compare bar from the bottom is gone okay so when I click on it again it will show the compare bar here you will see one product that we already had continue shopping and it will close that compare bar so when I click on this compare it has added that product so this is one of the variable product so you need to go to the product page and select the variation and then you can compare it okay, so we have added the variation so it is compatible with the variable products also so let's go ahead and change the setting right now it shows the open compare sidebar so let me change it to open compare table and let's go ahead and save the changes so let me remove these from comparison and let's go to all products we have changed the setting here now let me refresh the page or remove the cache okay now click on the compare button again right in the previous example the compare bar was in the right side so let's click on it again and it will open the compare table so this is the setting that we have changed open compare table so right now it is not opening the right side bar it is opening the compare table directly so from here they can add the product and from here they can remove the product you will see the image here they can remove the product from here also all right so this is how the compare table work and this is one of the free plugins that you can install on the woocommerce website so that's it for now see you in the next video do not forget to subscribe to my channel to get more quick tips about online softwares and tools if you have any questions please leave us message in comment section and press the like button if you like the video Thanks for watching Quick Tips.